I'm like in love with Poli <laughs> Polish <laughs> right now, it's so cool. <laughs> we'll find somebody who speaks English first. Yeah. No. Hmm. No soccer, okay. okay. It's poop poop. Booty balls? <laughs> Say it one more time. <laughs> Hello. Hi, my name is Montana and I'm from the US. Hi, I'm Songji and I'm from Korea. Hi, my name is Lucy and I'm from France. Hi, my name is Shaba and I'm from Hungary. Hi, I'm Hannah and I'm from Poland. Hi, I'm Julia and I'm from Italy. Hi, I'm Ria and I'm from Germany. Hi, I'm Naya and I'm from Belgium. Mm. <laughs> Tough question. Maybe Korean? Well, like coffee and like computer. Yeah. Very similar, and then like hand to phone is like kind of like phone. The Konglish. Yeah. Konglish, yeah. In English, we call it trash can. In Korean, we say seregitong. In French, poubelle. In Hungarian, we say kuka or samatech. In Polish, we say kosna smeti. In Italian, we say cestino. In German, we say mööimer. In Belgium, we say pullebak. Pullebak. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. What's the most commonly used word? Kuka is more like slang. Oh. Mm. It just sounds super weird. It's like very a, long. Yeah, it's like basket for trash. Basically. Oh. Yeah, yeah, we, we say that trash. we have that. Kosh too. is basket. Yeah. Ah. And the Schmidt is trash. Belle is pretty girl, but poop huh? is poo poo. <laughs> No, no, no. I'm sorry. I think so. Yeah, in German, it's exact translation of trash can. The first word is mu, it's trash, and Aima is, it's not can, but like a bucket. Oh. So, a trash bucket. Yeah. Um, in the US, we say elevator. In Korean, we say elevator. In French, we say ascenseur. In Hungarian, we say lift or Favono, but really just lift. Um, in Polish, we say Vinda. In Italian, we say Yashinsore. In German, we say Aufzug or der Lift, but people say Aufzug more than lift. In Belgium, we say lift. It's a lot of lift. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but if we say elevator in your country, then you guys don't understand. We'll find somebody who speaks English first. Yeah. Yeah, oh. yeah. <laughs> yeah same. Smart. Okay. Maybe the German one? The Aufzug? Aufzug? The Z is like weird, right? Yeah, it's a, it's a really sharp Aufzug. Like, it's kind of like T S. Oh, you speak okay. it like it's T S. Say it one more time. Aufzug. Aufzug. Yeah, that sounds really good. <laughs> Turn on the back. Good job. <laughs> In the US, we say soccer. In Korean, we say chukko. In French, we say football, foot. In Hungarian, we say foti or labdarugash. In Polish, we say piłka nożna. It's always so long. Yeah. <laughs> um, in Italian, we say calcio. In Germany, we say fußball. In Belgium, we say football. Wood? 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 Wood ball. So it's like that zip. Wood? You sound kind of like a dictionary woman. <laughs> oh, so piłka is a ball. Nožna is a, it's an adjective. So it's like a foot, but a, not a noun. Fi, footy, footy, <laughs> or something. <laughs> footy ball, something. <laughs> Maybe. Okay. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So footy is like a slang, slang version of football, but we say labda rugash, which actually means labda is ball, and rugash makes, you know, means kicking. Okay. So like. Ball kicking. So no word uses soccer. No. Like, hmm. No soccer. Okay. That's very weird. <laughs> <laughs> it is because we have football and then soccer. Yeah. yeah. That was so yeah. confusing to me because yeah. football okay. for us is like rugby. It's yeah. Like yeah. Rugby. Yeah. 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 Like okay. Yeah. Why yeah. do you say rugby for mm. rugby? In gotcha. Yeah. yeah. It's really weird. Um, I think the Polish one. <laughs> 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 it just looks like so confusing, <laughs> but when like yeah. she says it, it's so nice. I don't know. Yeah, In the US we say beer. In Korean we say vekju. In French we say bier. In Hungarian we say sher. In Polish we say pivo. In Italian we say birra. In Germany we say beer. In Belgium we say beer. Oh, <laughs> German and Belgium is like a mix with French. The R is like just a French R. I have a French R, I think that's why. Oh, maybe. Mm -hmm. How do you say it in French again? Bier. Oh. <laughs> oh it just gives me tingles in my ears. Yeah. <laughs> don't fall, try it, try don't it. fall in love with me. <laughs> but I already did. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Whoa. Whoa. Bier. <laughs> 
In America, we say principal. In Korean, we say 교장 선생님. In French, we say directeur. In Hungarian, we say Igor Gato. In Polish, we say director. In Italian, we say president. In Germany, we say director. In Belgium, we say directeur. A lot of directors. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Yeah. Be confused. <laughs> director. <laughs> I think of like a band director, like a oh, like the like yeah. concert band director. Igas mm. Gato, it's it sounds Japanese. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh yeah. yeah. Right? Yeah. Actually I think it's just person who's directing. Oh. But not not movies or anything no, like that. Yeah. It's just like a top. school, yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. Oh. So, um, a beat maybe? Kind of sounds like president. Yeah, yeah. President. Yeah. 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 president. Yeah. President. 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 Yeah, kind of. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> My ears are ready. <laughs> In English, we say math. In Korean, we say suha. In French, we say mathematique ou math. We say matek or matematica. Uh, in Polish, we say matematica. Similar. In Italian, we say matematica. In Germany, we say mathematic. <laughs> In Belgium, we say Wiskunde. What? <laughs> yeah. What? 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 Yeah, literally. We have an old word too, but like year by year, it's it's like disappearing. And also, it's for the easier version, like for elementary school. So for that, we say Samton, the the yeah. academics oh, okay. of numbers. Oh, oh, I think whiskey is kind of the same then, I guess. Yeah, the, the Belgian word like, can be understood Kunde with German. Like, yeah. yeah, because in Kunde in German is like the studies of a Study field. Of, yeah. So but I don't know I could, whiskey. Yeah, with knowledge. I think so, like wisdom is. Yeah, wisdom. In English, we say science. In Korean, we say kwahak. In French, we say science. In Hungarian, we say to the mind. In Polish, we say naukistiswe. In Italian, we say scienze. In German, we say Wissenschaft. And in Belgium, we say Wetenschap. Oh, you two are oh, very similar. Yeah. 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 I mean, yeah. it's Polish, what? Yeah. Okay, oh, so I have to explain that one. <laughs> we don't really use it. We don't have a subject called science at school. Mm. Ah. We would call it Shiroda, which is like nature. Oh, uh, and it's like a mix of all of those. Oh, so, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, it was so much fun. I'm like in love with Poli <laughs> Polish <laughs> right now. It's so cool. <laughs> but yeah, it was a lot of fun. So, Oh, uh, very interesting. Like what I noticed, obviously the Korean one does not sound like any other language, and also the Polish one. I'm like Everyone. so taken aback. Like I was really surprised. Just, yeah, it's just difficult. It's really hard. It's like a whole <laughs> sentence. <laughs> so that's really funny. I'm I'm always happy to see that German does have some similar words to other languages because there's like there's memes of Germany always being the one language that that like does not have the same word. Yeah. <laughs> So I'm happy that, you know, there is some words that are similar. It, I'm, it surprised me that we have really similar words, but like Poland and Germany are also neighbors and we don't have yeah, anything in common. So that's interesting. <laughs> I, I didn't think about this before. So today we talked about word differences. If you liked the video, please like and subscribe or leave a comment and we'll see you soon. Bye! Bye.